Hello there, Diocese of the Rio Grande. Welcome to General Convention 2022. This is the 80th General Convention of the Episcopal Church. I've arrived here in Baltimore, Maryland, and today is for all you Episcopal Church geeks out there, the unboxing General Convention Edition. So, you know, on uh, YouTube, there's all these unboxing or haul videos, you know, where people go shopping and then they, or some, they bought something and they like unbox the cool skateboard and stuff like that. So this is me unboxing the handy bag that they gave you when you sign in for General Convention. Oh, it's so exciting. I know you can barely contain yourself to because you're wondering what's in the bag. And I don't even know what's in the bag, but we're going to find out. First of all, when you sign in, they give you a badge, right? And you either have a deputy color badge or this is the purple one for the bishops, right? And it has your voter card on it and everything like that. No, you can't see my voter card because I don't want you to vote on my behalf. That's what I'm saying. Okay, so here we go. Unboxing, general convention, what's in the bag. First thing that's in the bag, not one, not two, not three, but five COVID tests. That's right. We're testing for COVID every single day at General Convention. Everybody is testing for COVID. So we got five COVID tests. I brought a couple anyway, because y'all know I'm trying to stay away from COVID. But five COVID tests. That's the first thing we got. What's next in the bag? Let's see. Next in the bag... Oh, it's a sugar cookie. See, because sometimes when you're doing lots of legislation, you need a little bit of sugar and fat to get you through the day. So we got that. I'm hoping there's some coffee in there to go with that sugar cookie. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? Okay, what else is in here? Let's see. Oh, there's a bag within the bag. Now, this is probably a special treat. Let's see what's in the bag within the bag. Okay, let's see. We have give thanks walking in the way of love all right so this is all right check it out it is a coloring book so you can do a walking in the way of love coloring book while you're sitting in committee meetings where people are talking too much like bishops talking too much right and you could do when love is the way and do some coloring there or maybe just to calm you down you know like like uh, meditative coloring there's even a prayer practice where you pray like you're doing an icon or something anyway so we have that that's good keep everybody chill at the general convention okay what else is in the in this bag we have keep cool and share the good news because you know it gets warm in the rio grande it really does but ugh, the humidity over here people in baltimore if you haven't been to the east coast in a while Remember what humidity is like? I wish we could take some of this rain home with me, but the humidity, that could stay here. Anyway, keep cool and share the good news. What else is in the bag? Uh, let's see. Care for God's creation. Walking in the way of love. A little bit of bamboo uh, flatware, tableware, to, to do your takeout meals with, which is good, but you know what? I already brought my set right here. So, see? I'm already on the page. Recycle your flatware there what else do we have oh prayers notes and doodles a little book to like take notes on write stuff in that's always very handy uh and oh colors to go with the coloring book right on see because i was wondering like all i got is a pen anyway now i got colored pencils good 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 what else is in here uh let's see refresh and restore uh oh a little starbucks gift card there we go all right go over there and get some caffeine to go with the cookie i think that's what that's about what else is in the bag we're not done we're not done wait don't stop don't turn it off we're not done we also have uh oh, oh got to get the glasses out for this one maybe you all can read that better than i can but it looks to me like that is a baltimore episcopal diocese of baltimore pin with the crab on it right because the crab cakes around here are really great. If you're a person who eats shellfish, go ahead and enjoy that. And then a fresh start. I think this is some gum or, yeah, that sounds like gum, right? Like chiclets or something to, to make your breath smell good in the mask. Because we're wearing the mask all the time. And, you know, um, little halitosis in the mask is not a good thing. So there we go. One last thing. We've got to go back to the big bag to get this one last thing. I had to sign a, a release for this. They were like gonna take my house and mortgage everything if I don't return this. Here it is, the iPad of Magic. This is the Magic iPad with the charger. 
And this iPad is, you know, I mean, you remember the iPads with the little button on them, right? This is uh, an iPad. This has all of the, uh, the way you vote, I think, and all the rest of the legislation is right here on this, which will go with my own iPad, um, which, I don't know, maybe I'll watch the Tour de France on it while this is being used for legislation. I don't know. Anyway, welcome to General Convention, everybody. It's going to be fun. It's going to be Episcopal Church time. I'll bring you further. Uh, uh, I'll bring you further messages as they unfold. Pray for your deputation from the Diocese of the Rio Grande. Pray for the House of Bishops and the House of Deputies. Pray that the Holy Spirit will be with us. Thanks be to God for the polity of the Episcopal Church and the fact that lay people, priests, and bishops and deacons all together. Uh, making decisions for the life of the church. Follow along. Go to generalconvention.org. There are live streams of both the House of Bishops and the House of Deputies all week. You can go coast to coast with this thing. We'll bring you up to date as the news unfolds. God bless you, Diocese the Rio Grande.